Hey everybody, my name is Ryan and today in this video I'll be talking about two unnoticed things in the trailer which just came out today from Treyarch. Now the first one is of an image which is a sign that says No Man's Land. Now this is basically kind of confirming that a No Man's Land type of area will be in Origins. I don't know how they're going to like where they would put it or how it's going to work because in Moon, the No Man's Land, um, you get some kills, you can buy Jug if you want to, run a rape train and you know pack a bunch if you wanted to but you would eventually teleport to the moon and start playing. Now this, you're not teleporting anywhere, or it's assumed we're not teleporting anywhere, um, so I don't know how they're going to do this no man's land. Maybe if you run in there, uh, get some kills and run out, and they'll stop spawning. Um, but I don't know, guys. It just There's a sign right here, and I'll be showing it in about two seconds. And I'll zoom it in. It's on the very bottom left corner of the screen right now. And you guys can see that it kind of says no man's land. It's kind of really, it's actually, it's very hard to see. But, you know, it does spell out no man's land. So that is... Um, the first image and then the second image I'll be talking about is uh, on screen right now. This image actually looks to be like a new perk. Now it is kind of hard to see but it's an image on the very far left and it does look like a perk machine. I can't really explain it because if I did I'd probably sound like an idiot. But you know it does look like a typical perk machine maybe like a juggernaut or a PhD flopper. Now a lot of people are thinking that PhD flopper will, will be returning and I disagree with that because in Mob of the Dead on Grief it was there um, just on Grief but it was the the perk was so overpowered to begin with. Um, you know, holding grenades when it kill you. you no know, falling damage would kill you, and that's why I think they brought it back in uh, in buried as just a perma perk without you know some of the effects of the actual perk. Like if you hold a grenade, you would still die, or if you fell too far, you would lose the perma perk instead of just taking no fall damage. And I think perma, I think PhD flopper was extremely overpowered, and I think that's why they they haven't really brought it back. And it was such a fan favorite, but you know they kind of teased us by hiding it in maps, but they haven't actually brought it back because it was kind of overpowered. So. Um, I'm going to zoom this in for you guys. I'm not really sure what this perk is. It looks to be some kind of light blue perk, and it does look like to be a perk machine because the image, the very far left image, which I am zoomed in on, on the right side of the image, it looks like there's a perk machine, and it looks like an arrow going up. So what could, like, could that be some kind of, like, flying perk? I mean, I don't really know. That's kind of, That sounds pretty stupid and, uh, you know, unrealistic, but what could that be? What could that arrow represent that it's going up? And then on the far left of that image, we also see a blue circle that looks to be like the symbol of the perk. So um, please leave me your comments, guys, below. Uh, I read them all. And, you know, there's a lot of good good comments out there that people, you know, sometimes don't want to comment because they think they, they'll feel stupid. Um, don't do that, guys. Just whatever you guys think this perk could be, leave me a comment, and I'll read through them. So thank you guys once again for watching. If you guys are new to my channel, please uh, subscribe and click the like button on this video so it'll help me get it out there. And you guys will never miss a video that I post. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for your support. My name is Ryan. Until next time, I'm out. Peace.